What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Pain vs. the World. Today, I got a special treat for you guys. Today, I will, I will be playing as Nagato Uzumaki, one of the greatest anime and tactics, also known as Pain. And I don't usually really play Naruto, but I just feel like, you know, I had to come back to the game. It's been a long time since I played the game, but I want to play it. I don't know, you know, you just get that strange urge just to play the game. But anyways, guys, enjoy the video. It's just mainly me being a goat whooping these guys' ass on the game. If you guys like the video, don't be afraid to hit that like button. If you guys want more content like this, hit the subscribe button. I got a whole bunch of bangers coming all along, all month long. And yeah, enjoy the video, guys. Let's get straight into it. Peace. Come here. Where you think you're going? Come here. Come here. The Chakra Dash is deadly. Stop playing with me, boy. Back up. Come here. Come here. Stop playing with me. Come. Look at him. I'm out here rotating on this nigga. Bam. Look at this. I'm whooping his ass with paper. Oh, look at this. I'm not going to hold you. Pain used to be deadly as fuck with all of them. Well, he had like six pains when he came to fight Naruto. Naruto had to beat the fuck out of all of them. But it was a really good fight. It's honestly, that's my favorite fight in the show. And I also think that's the best arc in the show. A lot of people might be like, oh, you're bugging. No, it's the fourth grade ninja world. But I personally love the pain arc. It's like really my favorite arc in the show. And I think it's one of the greatest arcs in anime history. You know, Naruto come in to defeat pain. Living up to the hero, that's like that was like the first time the village actually acknowledged Naruto, and it was just really beautiful when he beat Pain. The whole st like the whole, whole lesson of the story even applies to our world to today with Pain, the cycle of Pain, and like Pain had a, he, he said an interest, he had an interesting quote in the show. He said, You can't understand someone's pain unless you know you've been through it, and I feel like that's really true, but yeah. I try to get too deep into that, but this is something I just want to cover real quick. Almighty push deadly. Come here. Mm. Look at that. We oh look at that. Yo, get right back into the combo. Yup, come here. Fuck that nigga fell out the combo. But anyways, guys, what do you what do you think is the top three best shown in anime ever? In my opinion. I mean, I know a whole bunch of people might disagree, but in my opinion, the best three shonen anime of all time gotta be number one, Dragon Ball Z, number two, Naruto, and number three, One Piece. Those are my top three favorite anime of all time. Like, I, I don't think, because you know, they got their own unique stories, and Naruto, I mean, let's start off with Dragon Ball Z. Dragon Ball Z paved the way for a lot of anime. Transformations and shit didn't really exist before Dragon Ball Z. Like, um, interesting story arc, and like, Dragon Ball Z is just, you know, it's own class. As for Naruto, I think the sad story with the main character stuff started with Naruto. Before we got Deku, Asta, we had Naruto. So, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, I think Naruto has a lot to do with paving the way for stories where main characters aspiring to become someone great in society that everyone looks up to. So... I definitely say, uh, number four, let me see what would be number four. Uh, number four, um, oh, let me, uh, so this is my personal list. Number four, I have to give it to Yu Hakusho. Yu Hakusho is a classic anime, like, I love that anime. Yes, man, I'll never forget the first time watching that anime. Like, imagine the main character dying the first episode, how unique is that? You don't find too many anime like that. And with this, and, but Yu Hakusho could definitely been longer. It could have definitely went on longer. That's one of those series that I feel like, you know, they should have continued on with. As y'all can see, I got the dub. Too easy. Yo. Asuna. Asuna was a really good character, but you know, too bad. He went away. He was too, too, too much throughout the show. His death really fucked Shukamaru up. That was awesome, it was like this guy, man. He lost the mom. Look at this, bro. I'm just a, a beast, bro. Look. He don't use all his substitutions and he don't got nothing else to do. 
I'm look at him, bro. He ain't even trying to catch me with that weak ass finish shit. Boy, you don't get your ass right over here. Come here. I need the fuck out of this nigga. But let's see, my fifth enemy. My fifth enemy. There's a lot of enemy I haven't finished, you know? I started a lot of enemy, but I haven't finished a lot of enemy. So, number five at the list. Let me see. An enemy I really enjoy. Five, number five, number five. Uh, bro, the craziest thing about it is I talk about this list all the time with my friend, Gamer King Ali. Y'all go, go sub to his channel. If you fuck with Fortnite, definitely go sub to his channel. He has a whole bunch of bangers, trios, uh, cash cups, all that good shit. But yeah, I talk about anime. Anime list all the time with him. Let me see. Top, my number five. My number five, I'm gonna have to say Full Metal Alchemist. Like, growing up, I used to see my older brother watch Full Metal Alchemist and it was just really dope to me. The story for that is pretty cool too. Number six, uh, number six, uh, number six. Okay, number six will be My Hero Academia. I'm gonna put My Hero Academia there because My Hero Academia was there for me during that time, like I needed it a lot. So that's definitely why I put it there. And then My Hero Academia also has a great story, but My Hero Academia story, like, it was, like it's Loki reminds me of Naruto. But not really, because you know, it got his own powers and stuff like that. They got quirks and stuff. And Deku just, you know, he's powerless. But an uh, anime that reminds me a lot, like Naruto, is uh, Black Clover. With um, Asta having demon powers, you know, Naruto had the Nike and Fox and stuff. So that's a lot of similarities between those two shows right there. So, number seven, number, number seven anime might have to be. Uh, I've watched a lot of anime, but I haven't finished. So, my number seven. Oh, Erase. Erase, I don't know if I'll definitely put it at number seven, but Erase should definitely be my top ten. No, no, no. Hunter, Hunter number seven, but Erase is probably like number eight. Erase is, if you guys haven't watched Erase, you definitely check it out. Like, it's not one of those anime that has powers and power-ups and fighting and all that, but it's more like a detective show. It's really interesting and dope. You guys should definitely check it out. It's called Erase. If you haven't watched it, definitely go check it out. 9 and 10, I don't really know. There's a couple of animes I haven't finished yet, like Attack on Titan. The fourth season is approaching, and I feel like I need to definitely go catch up on Oh, Demon Slayer. Demon Slayer is definitely in my top 10. Demon Slayer should be... Nah, Demon Slayer, ah. Right. Demon Slayer number 6, My Hero number 7, Erase number 8, and two other animes. I love Demon Slayer. Although the manga, and the ending for the manga was really rushed, like and we only although we only have one season but i've read the manga and i know the anime is going to be spectacular so yeah that's definitely number six. Round two. Oh, so number six demon play number seven my Hero academia number eight race number nine I, i'm gonna put attack on titan there and number ten uh i don't know Shit. Huh. I watch a lot of anime. I just to finish a lot of them too. I don't know. That might have to be a blink for now. But yeah, guys. So we're about to wrap this video up soon. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. I got a whole bunch of awesome content planned throughout the month of June. If you like this video, drop me a like, subscribe, comment, and as always, stay tuned for more content. Let's just look. Let's just watch the video of me giving these things this ass whooping. Oh, they need this. I'm pretty sure I did win this match. Anyways, enjoy the vid, guys. I'm out. Peace. I, I'm, I hope you guys enjoyed the vid. See you for more content. Oh, yep. That's it. Pain was still up. Decided. 
Ideals without strength are nothing. Thank you.